guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're watching Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're watching episode 32 of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, and we are headed north. Scar needs to go north to get his brother's uh, research. Fallman's going north because he uh, pretty much has to. <laughs> That's where Bradley's sending him. Uh, the boys are probably going to go north to find May because they need an Alcahestry teacher. I don't know if she's willing to teach them. Uh, but uh, so I feel like everyone's shoving off north, except for maybe Roy and uh, Hawkeye. I think they're sticking around. I think they're staying. But also Kimberly is now in uh, pursuit of Dr. Marco. And he has a brand new philosopher stone, teeming with brand new souls. As sick as that is, I'm I'm excited to get into this because North has been something that I've been excited about since the new opening and seeing new characters that are in the North. I don't know if they're on our side or uh, if they're on a different side completely. Like you know, like all the people from Jing, they're not really on a side either. But I will say that um, I I feel like when I watched uh, another episode that they said that the North was like the one part of on the map that like couldn't be, I don't know, they, they couldn't fight them, they couldn't handle them, they couldn't take them, that they were too tough to beat. I'm not quite sure. And I don't want to go back and rewatch and cheat. Um, I could probably go back and rewatch my reaction because that's not cheating. Well, actually, I don't even think rewatching an episode is cheating. But uh, I, I, I definitely think something was said about the North being kind of formidable. Uh, so I'm really excited about that. But uh, uh, I, I think Lan Fan and Fu are also going to be headed north because I don't think Lan Fan uh, is going to give up on Greed. I don't know if Greed's heading up there either. I, I don't know if everyone just shifts up north or not, but I'm excited to find out. So guys, very short intro, only two minutes long. Let's get into it. Yeah, you're right. It does look like her. Oh. I don't think so. Where are you hiding? Out in the open, apparently. She's so cute. The fur son. Oh, are we 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 going to talk about Salim, who I think might be secretly pride? I don't know. The purple eyes throw me off. That's an interesting outfit you're wearing. Where are you from, dear? Sheen, actually. It seems like somebody who's undercover. Oh, that's me! This is the Thank final you call for all, all your help, ma'am! Do you, do you have Jaime? dearie. Oh, okay. Huh? Jaime. I've never seen a cat like that. That was a weird woman. I, I don't know if that's mean, but that was a weird woman. He was seen with a middle-aged man who had black hair, right? Yes, that's what it said in the report, sir. Ew, people reporting to Kimberly and saying, sir? Gross, I don't like it. West City? West, huh? North. We need to go north. Scar must be getting desperate. He's leaving us a good trail. All right, it's time to get to work. How come he gets to wear a fancy suit and he doesn't have to wear an alchemist, state alchemist, like, uniform? He was in the military. Yo, oh, the weird lady. <laughs> a suspicious woman. But that isn't my job. Well, I want to know about the suspicious woman. It never gets easier. Looks like a few. Oh, is it the chess guy? Gosh. <laughs> you still look plenty young to me. <laughs> yeah. Is that, a Roman? Is that you? I thought the situation must be serious. Yeah, I mean, he doesn't make a, a pretty convincing woman. Now I see why you're known for being eccentric. Eccentric? I think I'll choose to take that as a compliment. I think he means it as a compliment. Now, what is it you need? 
<laughs> Even Raven, too. He wanted to know if I'd be interested in a core of immortal soldiers. Whoa. Uh, immortals? A core of immortal Did soldiers? Did And not long after that, I was transferred. Interesting. You, you were demoted. Yeah. Do you remember the difficulties that we had in Lior? They brought the uprising under control. But then the forces from Central came in. Yeah. And the peace in Lior was shattered. After the Central forces appeared. What are they planning now? And why can't they hold off? I'm almost retired. <laughs> oh, what about you? <laughs> Careful now. You don't want to mess up your makeup. Right, ma'am? Oh my, no! <laughs> Oh yeah, oh yeah. He knows a little something about that that little that weird cat. Calm down, Ed. Crossing the desert in auto mail sounds hot. What? Who is it? Armstrong. Oh, there you are, Edward Elric. Damn it, Major! What do you want? Shh! This is a library, you know. <laughs> Take this. What is it? Oh. Even further north than Northern Command, you'll find an officer nicknamed the Northern Wall of Briggs, Major General Armstrong. <gasps> what? <laughs> What? She's an Armstrong? Ah! I'm excited for that. Oh my god, no wonder. Everyone was like really excited for me to meet her too. So exciting. There's no escape for you now, Scar. Where's May? Oh, you know what? So random. I was in a burger place here in town called Fugu Burger, and they had anime playing, and they had Full Metal Alchemist playing, but I didn't know what episode it was, and I was trying not to watch it. And I remember seeing Scar on a train. Who's this? They did say it was specialized for the medical field. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's Celine. You are wearing a full suit of armor. Does that mean you're the Full Metal Alchemist's brother? Oh. Uh, yeah, I am. Awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Library. Shh. It's called Alkahestry. It's alchemy from the country Xing. But you and your brother are already good enough at alchemy to practice here in Amestris. So why would you guys look into the kind of alchemy they practice in a foreign country? Don't tell them. <laughs> well... <laughs> Alkahestry is supposed to have a lot of medical uses, so I'm just doing some research to see if any of its properties can be used to save people's lives. Smart, Al. Does that mean you're Edward Elric, the Full Metal Alchemist? Yeah. Oh, cool! You are a tiny alchemist, just like everyone says! Tiny. Say it again, once more. <laughs> you me. That's true, too! You hate being called small, just like everyone <laughs> says! <laughs> uh, Master Salim, are you yeah. Salim Bradley? Yeah. Salim, the Fuhrer's son? That's me! Oh, is that their house? Jeez. I want to become a state alchemist just like you, Ed. Uh, just like me. Aww. And then I'll be able to help my father out as well. Uh. And what kind of man is he? An amazing man. He spends all day every day thinking about the people of this country. Not in a good way. The first time we met, he made me so angry I actually slapped him. Mm. <laughs> Interesting. But it worked out the best. He asked me out after that, and our first date was amazing. Oh, sorry. Yeah, a little too much there, but interesting. I had some free time for a change, so I thought I'd check in on my family. Mm-hmm. Sure. And I also happened to hear that the full metal alchemist and his brother were paying us a visit. Yep, there it is. 
So, you ran into these two at the library, Salim? Yep! Oh, no. Don't tell him why. Well, it's because we aren't related by blood. We were unable to have any children of our own. Hmm. So we adopted Salim, and he's our son now. Can't, because he's a homunculus. Aw, oh, Daddy. You're leaving already? You know I have duties to get back to, Salim. At least he didn't tell him about the Elka history. Yet. I kind of don't know what to think about that whole thing. It's sad. Neither Selene nor his mother know what Fuhrer Bradley really is. We don't know that. Huh? Come on, let's go. We're headed north. <laughs> let's go north. We'll be there soon. Get some sleep. <laughs> I see. He managed to escape us again, did he? I mean, they could have just jumped to a different train. Is it possible the two we're looking for jumped off? Oh yes, it's possible. You don't say. All right then. After they jumped off, which way would they go? North? Or south? North. So is May with... what's his face still? That is not the end of the episode. Okay. Well, I know that there's an end credit scene, so <laughs> a little morsel more. You know, come to think of it, I don't even know if Marco is with Scar. That could be that Yoki guy, for all I know. This is the first time we've ever been so far north. I wonder if we'll see any snow. That would be something. I might like to see that snow. Might be a little cold with the auto mail. Please have more. Nope. Okay. Okay, so Scar is somewhere with someone. Uh, they never really specified who he was with, and I think we're meant to assume that it's Marco. Um, and maybe May is taking Marco north, and he has Yoki. It's quite a possibility. Um, I didn't really think of that, that, like, he could be, like, pulling everybody away from Marco so that she can take him north. Um, uh, I don't know, run about, like, why that would be... Maybe it's so he can actually face Kimberly. Maybe that'll happen sooner than I think? I don't know. But now I'm thinking that he has Yoki instead of, uh, uh, Marco with him. Uh, it's just because they never showed his face, so I'm just like, they don't want us to see Marco's face. And I'm like, well, he would be healed or at least bandaged because of May healing him. Uh, but that's not the case. They're not showing him. So I think it's a bait and switch. Um, and then, my goodness, of all the people in the world that we run into in the library, Salim, of all people. And, you know, like, he's a big fan of the Elric brothers. He's a big fan of alchemy, and he wants to be just like his dad and help his dad. And, like, it's funny because I was just like, it's like, is, is Selene pride? Because obviously Bradley can't have children because he's a homunculus. But, like, I was like, well, maybe it's a possibility. And now that's kind of a fleeting thought. Um, and especially because, you know, like, Bradley, he said something about, like, you'll nev they'll never be able to use my son against me. And it's because I don't think that, like, he really has the capability of, like, like really loving his son. I'm I'm not sure because like it even seemed like his son was really disappointed that he was going back to work. And yeah, I mean, definitely would be if you want to spend time with your dad, but it sounds like he doesn't get to spend a lot of time with his dad. Um, and he might have idealized who his dad is by always like being proud of him and like all this stuff. So I, I'm I'm not sure what to think. Uh, he was really cute talking to Ed and Al. Like he knew that Al like was the the brother of the full metal alchemist uh he did <laughs> in fact call ed tiny and then also told ed oh yeah you are like somebody who gets upset about being called small and like the flames that shut up behind ed <laughs> in his mind was fantastic i absolutely love that but you know like going to bradley's home um, I was like, well, this is uncomfortable. And then he's like, oh, what were you guys doing in the library? And it was like, no, oh, God, don't tell him. Don't say the words Alka Hestri. Don't say it. But if anything, you know, Salim could at least say that Al wanted to look up, you know, medical stuff. And like, 
maybe, you know, Bradley would think that they were looking up alkahestry to get their bodies back, not necessarily to fight alchemy, because Bradley wasn't down in with father and all of them fighting. So maybe he doesn't know that people lose their alchemy or that father can do that or that alkahestry works when alchemy doesn't. Know what I mean? But also, 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 let's not bury the damn lead. Uh, well, I guess it's not the lead, but like the, the big nugget of information. Hello, Armstrong, showing up to give an envelope and saying, give this to her. It might not matter now. A major Armstrong? They're related? I knew I liked her. I knew I liked her. Now, you know what? Just because somebody finds out that like, other people are related. That doesn't automatically make them awesome by association, but I feel like I feel like we've heard a lot about the Armstrong bloodline and like how things run in the family, and she's got to be amazing. That that's that's my mindset. Um, but he said if she will have you or if she accepts it. So maybe there was maybe a mild falling out. I'm not sure. Maybe she didn't fight in the Ishfallen War and she's upset with her brother. Uncle? Cousin? Somebody? For fighting in the Ishvalan War. I don't know what that was, but it happened. Um, yeah. <laughs> now I'm super excited to get more of her story. But with Kimberly in pursuit of uh, Scar and everyone having to head north... I don't know how long it's going to take us to get there, but it's really funny that I was, I, I said it in the middle of the reaction, but I was at a, a burger joint here in town called Fugu Burger, and they always have anime stuff like up on the walls, but they actually have like scenes from anime playing, um, and they had Full Metal Alchemist because I recognized Ed and Al, and this was like at the very beginning of me watching it. I think I was like maybe four or five episodes in and I was like, oh, and I was like, that's Full Metal Alchemist. Like, I can't watch it. Like, and I like I kept noticing my eyes like straying up and I definitely remember seeing Scar on a train. I didn't even know his name was Scar. I didn't know who he was. I don't remember what happened, but now I'm thinking Kimberly and him might have a fight on a train. It's a possibility. I, 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 I clearly remember saying like, oh, it's on there. It might have even gone up on my Instagram. I might have like said like trying not to watch Full Metal Alchemist as it's up on the thing. Um, but like uh, the, the fact that they had it playing in the restaurant and that I was like trying to not watch it and that I had like even recognized it. Like I'm very proud of myself. Very proud of myself for somebody who does not watch anime to be like, hey, I know that show. Yeah, look at me. Growth. Uh, yeah, so I'm, 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 I'm excited to get to Major Armstrong. I'm excited to get to the Kimberly Scar meeting. Uh, and I'm definitely excited for the boys to be heading north and to see snow. So I, I would take it in the south, it doesn't snow. Like there's not like a northern, southern hemisphere kind of situation where you get winter at different times. But um, for them to actually see snow, like Ed was wearing like a winter coat. I don't know how auto mail does in uh, the, the winter. Um, I don't know if it gets like stiff and rusty. I don't know if Al can function when it's cold. He won't feel cold, but like he will be cold to the touch. So, hmm. Uh, but then also we had Grumman that showed up uh, as as a woman. Is it Grum Grauman or Grumman? I wrote the name down, but it might be Grauman. Uh, but he shows up at the grave of Hughes and is talking to Roy. And like, it's so nice to have somebody that Roy can trust, supposedly. Um, he was offered an immortal like core to come to wherever he was to, to work under him. And he's just like, immortality is effing weird. Like, get out of here. Like, no way. No, thank you. And he was transferred. And that totally makes sense. Um, but then also them like talking about, ah, uh, what is the name of the city? The one where the priest was, ah, uh, I can't think of it now. They mentioned it like twice. You'd think that it would like stick. Lenore, Lior, Lior. Um, and like how, like they were kind of getting everything under control. And then when central showed up, everything just went to shit. 
And so like, that's kind of probably what they do is they start conflicts in places. And even if they're getting under control by the people that are kind of in charge of controlling that central shows up, causes chaos. And now they're just kind of expanding their circle. And I also noticed on the map that like they have the north, but then there's like an extra north. And I think that was the north that I was talking about originally beyond the wall, beyond the wall in the north. Winter is coming. Oh, my gosh. Major Armstrong. At least that's what I think I got out of that. My God, if I got excited and that wasn't even what happened. Hold on, let me go back. Major General Armstrong. She looks dope. <laughs> Miss Grumman? <laughs> the question mark? I didn't see that the first time. Uh, yeah, so uh, Major General Armstrong. Ah, I'm so excited. I cannot wait for that. But guys, if you want to watch the full length reaction to this episode, it will be available on my Patreon and up to four episodes early. But in the meantime, like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. What are you excited about, General Major Armstrong? Uh, were you shocked? I was. I'm excited. Can't wait to get there. Uh, uh, Salim, did you think the jig was up? Did you think that like he was going to blab to his father about like what they were researching? I don't know if he would have put together that they were like trying to learn Elka history to fight alchemy when alchemy has been taken away. But I think Al mentioning the medical part will definitely like, if it's brought up later, they just be like, Oh, they're trying to get their bodies back. Hopefully, hopefully. I just did not think that that was a good idea. I am really looking forward to the scar Kimberly like meetup. And do you think, and if you've already seen the episode, you don't necessarily have to like say it in the comments, but if you are watching along with me and at, at this point, do you think that Marco is with Scar? Because I'm starting to think that it's Yoki, <laughs> which would be incredibly smart to keep Marco safe. The guy who knows how to make a philosopher stone to keep him away from Kimberly, who wants more of those yummy nerds. I don't know. I just call them yummy nerds. I don't know. They, they just like remind me of like a candy. It's more like a throat lozenge, especially for Kimberly. But like, like, I don't know. I feel like they taste kind of sweet, like nerds. Maybe I just want nerds. I don't know. Guys, I don't know what's happening half the time. But come back here for the next episode because uh, the closer we get to the north, the closer we get to General Major Armstrong. I hope she's dope. Hopefully uh, I'm not let down. But guys, in the meantime, I'll see ya.